Let's make a card with our beribboned frame dies and our Love Easter embossing folders and dies. You know, when, as card makers, we all like to reach out to someone for any occasion, and this card is so beautiful. We'll start by creating the perfect background with our beribboned frame dies, then create an embossed layer with a little bit of inking and embellish with some beautiful spring embellishments. So to get started, I'm going to take a, a five by seven piece of paper along with my A plate, my, metal, my magnet plate for the cuddle bug, the B plate. This die is enormous, so be careful. <laughs> you, you want the, the die face up and the paper face down. And then you'll put it through the cuddle bug. This is really important to get a nice even pressure and the cuddle bug does that every single time. So one of the things that I like to do in getting started with this die, you see how it actually cracks and makes a lot of noise. This is something that you just want to do very easily and make sure it's suctioned to the table. This die is not going, we're not going to emboss it. We're just going to use just the frame layer and I'll get my die cut started with my tool in one and just go through and get it, the paper worked out of the die and get it started. What's so beautiful about these dies is that they cut so in such an intricate way. You see how you can go ahead and continue weeding and you'll get even the prettiest pieces coming out of this die. This is actually one of my favorites in the set. So I'm going to start by creating a really pretty card and, and I'm going to do everything in red and gold. And so before, beforehand, I took a piece of paper and I embossed it with our Wildflower Blooms folder from the spring folders. And what you want to do with that embossing is you want to just take a little ink pad. I like gold, our gold metallic. And you want to gild the design by brushing the ink over the embossing. And it's pretty even when it smears because it looks like it's been hand painted. And you see what's happening. That's really pretty. And you just do that until you're happy with what the look is all about. Now that's my favorite layer. So we'll go back and build the card and start with that gorgeous frame. It goes right in the middle. Then I'm going to cover it up, which believe it or not is kind of fun. Cover up the pretty. I'm going to add that beautiful embossing. And then I've taken one of my flower cutting dies. You see that we've had the rose from the spring em embossing folders and die set. It's so pretty. This makes an outline of a flower, which also looks like the design in the embossing. I'm going to add some embellishments. And then a perfect little sentiment. And everything about this just comes together so effortlessly because everything you're using is so pretty. Now that's beautiful in the making.